silicone sealant. You can use any brand but make sure it says 100% silicone. To take out the silicone, you will need this kind of caulking gun. You can also buy silicone in small pack which doesn't need this caulking gun. I'm using cornstarch. There is no exact measurement. Just sprinkle some cornstarch in the bowl. Take out the silicone. It's better to make the molds in small batches uh, because silicone starts setting quickly. So I'll make only one or two molds at a time or in one batch. Now start mixing them together. Silicone is so sticky so just keep putting it with your stuff and keep moving. I found if you mix like this you can avoid the stickiness. Keep mixing the contrast till you get a low light consistency. Once you think your silicone is ready, uh, just apply some petroleum jelly. Now I don't want to waste my silicone so I will uh, cut out the excess and use it for another move. You will need to do it quick till your silicone is soft otherwise it will go waste. I will use it for another mold. I still have some space left here so here are uh, some earrings which I can use for mold. I let it dry for half an hour and now I will take out these things and we will see how it turns out. The mold feels firm and strong and these things are coming out so easily. This is so steely good. Okay, let's see the other procedure. So here I have some water in the bowl. I'll mix some dish soap in it. It can be of any brand. Uh, this is without using cornstarch. Now I'll put some silicone sealant in water.
Now you need to knead all the seeds corn while it is in the water. The water and soap mixture keeps it uh, from sticking to your hands. Please don't use the gloves. I have done it and ended up with all the stickiness. You need to keep kneading till the transparent silicone turns little cloudy and gets little hard. You can also add paint if you wish at this stage. It will get dough like consistency in like 5 minutes. I'll flatten it on the cooking paper. Here I have some plaster Paris flowers and leaves. I'll place them upside down just like we did earlier. Let it set for half an hour. Now we'll take out the uh, leaves and flowers. The leaf got those because it was made of plaster of Paris and it was really thin. But the mold turned out really great. It is more soft and flexible than the earlier one. But as per my requirement, I need it more firm because I'm going to use it for clay mostly. If you're going to use it for raisin or something, you can use the softer one. As I said, I mostly use it with clay. I will go with the first one, the cornstarch one. I can show you some ideas. This one I made with the seashells. Uh, these are some uh, clay seashells as well as the real seashells. This was my own creation with the clay. So by making molds of your own creation, you can make more copies of it. Again, one more wooden apple. Here are some corn. I use this spray mostly uh, for making borders. This is a plastic toy. These are some miscellaneous things like a butterfly, gears, bows. Again, one more Vihans toy. So these are the molds I made with 